welcome back to my channel. I am so glad that you guys came over today to see this new haul. So I have been shopping yesterday and today and I just wanted to show y'all what I got because you know sometimes it's like you run here and you run there and it's like what did you get? So I'm going to show you guys what I got at Target today. Um, I ran to Aldi's to look for pumpkins. They didn't have pumpkins but I ran to Aldi's, got a few things and I'll show you. We went to Books A Million and Bath and & Body. So lots and lots of fun stuff to show you guys. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and on to the haul. All right, this is my Target haul, y'all. It was like $2.50. It's so much, oh my gosh, but it's because I got three pairs of jeans. You can't try anything on, of course, so I have to try them on and take them back. Um, this is a sweatshirt. I actually got the other one that says Be Merry, or it says Mary on it, so it's just this sweatshirt. It's really, really soft, oh my goodness, but it was like $20 by itself. I got this button-up shirt for my little guy. And I wanted to get it just in preparation for Christmas just because this is stuff I got from at the dollar spot. These little houses are so cute. Look at they have little lights inside of them. They can go either way. I thought they'd be really cute for my tear tray. I got two of them. So I'm going to decide which ones and if I need both of them. I'm not sure. They're a little bit different. Like that's a long house. Um, I also got all of these reversible signs from the Target dollar spot. They are they were all $5 and they have a message on the back side of all of them. These little star lights I got there too. I got two packs, they were $3. And look at how cute they are. I really like those. Just some little Halloween candy for us to put out um, since it's about a week away. I got this cute little shirt with the red or the green on it and it's a little polo shirt. Normally $9 marked down to $6.30, so I went ahead and just grabbed that for my little guy. Um, he's kind of like, not in between sizes, but almost out of an 810, so I thought this will get him through um, for a while. I did get him this other shirt that was $6, and it has all the moon phases on it. It's just a short sleeve though. They had all their long sleeve out, but I like particular long sleeves for my kid. Um, he's like, more of an average height. I wouldn't say he's tall because we're not tall at all. And I like when the wrist, like your wrist things, have um, like the cinched in elastic on them. So a lot of theirs, their long sleeves weren't like that. Blurged on these for myself. I was looking for this pattern because I bought shorts in this pattern from the same brand. And these are so soft. These two packs, oh my gosh, perfect Christmas gifts. So dang soft, you guys. Oh my gosh. I And I love, love, love this pattern. Oh my goodness. Love it. Love it so much. I really wanted to get just the regular kind of um, like cloth material, the flannel. They didn't have it. This is more of like a really soft fleece kind of material, I guess you would call it. And it's like incredibly soft and... Um, I thought, you know, I'm just gonna go for it. So that was kind of a splurge to me. So you can see I got three pairs of jeans here. So I got um, the mid-rise skinny, the mid-rise boot cut, and these ones here, and these ones here that are like a boyfriend cut. And so I'm gonna try all these on. I didn't know what size I needed and I'm just not sure, so I'm gonna end up taking it back, but my dressing rooms are closed. I don't know if that's at all Target's, but at mine, at least the one close to my house, dressing rooms are all closed. So that really made my total pretty high because I think most of these were like $30 a piece. So it's probably over $100 just in these three pairs of jeans. And I couldn't really decide. So I'm gonna end up just going upstairs, trying these on, figuring out what I want, and then after church tomorrow, taking back what I don't want and figuring out what sizes I need. I got six bags of this Boom Chicka Pop because I'm doing a wine fairy. We have a wine fairy in my neighborhood, if I haven't told you guys. And it, I'll link my last, um, I think it was Costco haul that I talked about the wine fairy. So I try to do at least um, two things a month and um, give out, basically it's like you give out gifts to your neighbors. <laughs> and so usually it's, because it's the wine fairy, it's wine, and you get some snacks too. So I usually buy this because I feel like everybody likes that. So I feel like that's an easy, easy snack. So these were the signs. This garland, I only found these two packs. And 
for some reason, like, it just said, you need to get this. I have no idea if I'm going to put it on a tree or what. They were $3 a pack. I liked the little beads in them. I don't know. For some reason, I just felt like you need to get these. And if you don't, you will regret it. I also got these two gnomes. Oh my gosh. So in my tier tray this year, I wanted to put some gnomes. This guy I'm actually going to put in, and I'll show you guys. Um, he was the only one that they had that looked kind of fall. And then they had one that had this weird, like, mustache. But um, I thought this one was super cute. And then this Santa one. I actually got a different kind of Santa one that had a chef hat for um, my tier tray at, at home. But this guy was so much cheaper. He's $3. So I think I'll try to incorporate both of them. And I think it will be so cute. Here are the other sides because they're all reversible. And I didn't know which sides I liked better, but I actually liked the idea of having the options. All right, this is my bonus shopping that I did yesterday that I'll show you guys. Um, went to Bath and Body Works. This is my favorite scent, the End of the Stars, and I actually just got the um, body scrub, and then it was buy two, get one free. So I got Golden Sunflower and um, two little things of... Uh, hand sanitizer. I think these were only $1.98. And then this is my favorite candle for Thanksgiving, the Grateful. And I really liked the packaging of the white and the black. This is my little Books a Million haul. Do you guys go to bookstores still? Put that in the comments below. Let me know. I still, I buy books online, but I also really like to go to the bookstore. Um, the, my son really wanted this. I hope that it works good. And I really wanted to, somebody was talking to me about this book, so I wanted to get it. And then this was just a notebook, and I really, really liked the pattern. So I went ahead and got those, and my son actually picked out a book as well. And then I did want to get the membership um, because you get free shipping and coupons and all that, and I wanted to get that before Christmas. So I got that. This is my tiny little Aldi's haul. We went in search of pumpkins and there was no pumpkins so i guess i have to go to all these tomorrow i got these to hand out um if i run out of candy all my candy is still back there y'all oh is this your book ryan you're gonna show us um he brought it to show us it is like a minecraft book that he picked out it is minecraft and my besties my beast and my bestiary my bestiaries yeah. Yeah, so it has, um, oh, it looks like the Minecraft guy. Okay. So that is what he picked out, and he got that. I'm kind of like a mom sucker for books. I really like, okay, it's a book? All right. <laughs> so it talks about all the people in Minecraft, and him and his friends play Minecraft, and they build all these amazing, huge worlds. So, so cute. So the rest of my Aldi's haul is I got these actually for my husband's stocking. Since he's out of town, I wanted to stock up. And I got these, so they're just pistachios. And I really like that the packaging was green though, because I was just going to get the ones at Target. And I was like, oh, this looks kind of festive. I like that. So I got two of those. I really wanted some broccoli for some dinners this week. Um, and I really am enjoying cooking fresh broccoli lately rather than frozen. Just randomly grabbed this because I was like, I need that in my life. And um, so it's just iced coffee. And these I'm actually going to put in with my uh, wine dusting. So I got two bags of them. And most everybody likes chocolate. So I'm going to put that in and some face masks. And maybe I'll show you guys when I end up doing um, my dusting. I think I might get the bags together and try to dust soon random public stuff still out from yesterday on my way home i went and got my nails done and on my way home um that's when we went to bath and body and to books a million and then we stopped at Publix. i got this because um i needed some like color slave bleach and so i thought i think this is the right stuff cross my fingers of course stocked up on diet coke i needed one of these for upstairs because i keep just having to like take the wand upstairs if you guys haven't tried this oh my gosh game changer it's amazing uh i really wanted to go to Publix for this this is my favorite um 
the Waterloo and I really really like it and I end up putting the Arbonne Fizz in it and because I have strawberry fizz right now that's why I wanted the water and yeah I'm actually drinking one right now we got Dr. Pepper for my husband and my son all right these are a few stocking stuffers that I got for my child I just had to send him upstairs um, because I was like give me five minutes but um, aren't these so cute I got these they actually had a ton of like girl ones and so I hope this isn't too girly I just thought he would think it's funny um, we have masks that my friend made us but I just thought that was cute for three dollars and you know what better 2020 uh, this is his favorite gum he really likes peppermint gum I got him these because I figured he could like um, I could unwrap him and put him in his stocking they were like seven dollars each and then he has a ton of like nerf darts so i don't feel too bad about that i got him these and i don't know if these are i'm not sure if they're like too old for him or not or too young for him i mean but i might give them to my neighbor's son who's like real small too um instead but it's like you basically like each thing is a, like a little lego thing and at the end it makes a little cute train I just thought it might be something different and fun but like I said I might give this to another little kid instead um, each one of these things were a dollar these were seven dollars I want to say gum was a dollar nine and then this mask was three dollars so I think that was it those of all the shopping that I've been doing over the last couple of days I hope you guys enjoyed this haul have you guys been stocking up on Christmas stuff because I am trying I really don't want to be like last minute trying to get everything. I would really like to get done sooner rather than later, but you know how that is. I'm sure I'll be buying stuff here and there up until, but I am trying. So leave me a heart emoji in the comments below if you have started your Christmas shopping. And do you guys do stockings too, or is it just presents? Let me know. I will see you guys in another brand new video. Bye for now. <laughs> this is my mom's dog and my son. Aren't they cute?